What's on the menu today? Cookies of the mega kind. Let's get into it, you sweet Eeks. What do we have first? It's Megalicious Cookies, and I have been wanting these so bad for so long, and I sent them to Natalie and I said, can we order these cookies? And she said, those don't look good to me. I said that? Yeah. I feel like I was talking about another cookie company that has the pudding inside of it, who I will not name on this video. No. It's like pudding and mousse and shit and whatnot in oh. a lot of these cookies. Well, I guess we'll see how I feel because they look good right now. What will we start with? I want to save lemon till the end. Let's do s'mores. Nothing but s'mores. Nothing but s'mores. This is a soft baked cookie rolled in graham cracker crumbs and swirled with mini marshmallows, chocolate covered graham crackers, and the limited edition marshmallow topped Reese's peanut butter cups filled with a rich peanut butter chocolate pudding, then topped with whipped marshmallow cream, chocolate shell, and candy crumble. I just, I don't see how we could really not like these cookies. Good. <laughs> Wait your turn. Okay, so you guys know it looks good. It looks good. Yeah, we get a lot of peanut butter. Very soft. I love the mm. texture. I get the marshmallow. I did like a straight in bite. Which way did you bite it? Like the, the top. top. Yeah, because the marshmallows at the top. I like this a lot. I do too. Mmm. I'm still eating it. Mmm. It's sugar. It's, it's sugar. Good. It's pudding in the middle? It said it was a peanut butter pudding, but it didn't give me... It's not like a like a snack pack. Like, I want my snack pack, not that kind of a pudding. You know I like snack pack. Why can't you just give me a snack pack? Oh, this is bad. Mm. That I'm going to sit here and eat this much of cookie. I on, want to. On the beginning of the review. I want to, mm. but I'm not going to. Oh, on. Mm. That was good. Mm. Okay. <laughs> it's good. We started off with the sugar. <laughs> Next. What if they only get better? Oh. We've never done a review where it's just like, winner, winner, ah! Next, we have spectacular tiramisu, whipped Biscoff fudge chunks, caramel cold brew M&Ms, Ladyfinga biscuits, lotus Biscoff cookies, creamy white chocolate chips, vanilla Biscoff mascarpone cream Ooh. filling. Okay, so you got me. Mm -hmm. High hopes on this one too. Do you like tiramisu? I as a dessert love tiramisu, but I'm picky about it. You have to do it the way I want. That's what she said. Look, look, watch it. <clears throat> mm. You Let's know see. you want it. Let's okay, wait. See. Let me remove the piece that I don't care about. Look, it's all, that's all soft. It's worthless anyway. You guys know we don't like the stale pieces on top. It's a garnish, whatever. Yeah, it, it looks cute. But also, if you didn't make it, I'm not interested, especially with the price of these Megalicious cookies. These are $13 per cookie. They are easily the most expensive gourmet cookie that we have purchased on Sweet Relief. You already know what I'm gonna say about this cookie. No, because it just got in my mouth hole, so I'll tell you what you're gonna say. I tell you what, woman, this doesn't taste like tiramisu. It tastes very much like coffee. It does not taste like tiramisu. You know what I taste? Sugar. Biscoff. Oh, do you? That's all I taste. And it reminds Where? me, I just taste the Biscoff. I don't Where? know. Maybe in the pudding part? I'm eating the pudding now. Hold on. Let me see. Oh yeah. So there wasn't a lot of pudding in my first bite. That, yeah, ooh, that's good though. I, I, like, I like the cookie. It is not tiramisu. Mm -mm. I want that pudding all by itself. All I get is the Biscoff, and I feel like that's a theme. If people put Biscoff in the cookie, that is all the flavor that I taste, which I like the flavor, but if I'm expecting like a combination of something else, then it doesn't really work for me. You don't taste the coffee? No, but I'm gonna eat one of these M&M's. The cookie mm. is very whatever to me, but the pudding in the middle is so good. I like the- I wish I could order a tub. Just espresso M&M's. That's where I get the coffee. Did you say espresso? No, espresso. Okay. Either way, I thought it was a good cookie. Was it 
giving tiramisu, no. No, it was not. The next cookie is called Cinnamon Crunch Delight. I will not be providing you with the description because I cannot find it. Look at that. Just look at it. Look at it. Would you look at this? Oh, would you look at this? <laughs> yeah, well. Would you look at that? Eat it. Ooh. Cinnamon Crunch Toast Delight. Eat Cin one. Eat cinnamon. one by itself. Eat like a cinnamon toast puppy chow. That's good. It's not good. Shut up! Hey, mine doesn't. No, 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 no. <laughs> mine was stale. We had stale, but the flavor is good. Mm. We have found a theme of loving cinnamon cookie products. What say you? Don't I don't dislike it. It's just kind of eh for me. I think it might be interesting slightly warmed. It's a no for me, dog. Why it's a no for you, dog? I don't get a lot of, I, I don't get a lot of cinnamon. I'm not, I, you know what I get? Biscoff. Same. When I first put that in my mouth hole, I thought, wait, was this a Biscoff cookie? Mm -hmm. No, this was the cinnamon. And then it just kind of went away. So I don't know, maybe there's something to that. This pudding is not cinnamon. Cinnamon? Taste it. Cinnamon girl. Next cookie! Yeah, let's just move on. <laughs> I want to do this chocolate one next. <laughs> this cookie is brownies and cream. It's homemade brownie chunks. Okay, point for homemade. White chocolate mm. chips, double stuffed Oreos, Hershey's cream, cheese, baking chips, filled with a hefty Oreo cream mousse, finished off with whipped cream frosting and a chewy brownie square. That's it. It's beautiful. Oh my God. I want you to order this cookie. I want you to scoop all of the mousse out of the center. I want you to get the f out of here with it. It is so good. Now I will tell you about the rest of the cookie. I just want to eat the filling. Mm. Look at it. Oh, mm-hmm. Mm. 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 You guys, God damn. That's good. But you know what? It's sugar. That's fucking sugar. Good job, Megalicious. That was really good. All right. We are in the home stretch. This is the one that Aaron's all boo boo butt hurt that it's not the berry white cookie that she ordered. Smells and looks like a, a praline, you know, like you get in Savannah. You guys know what I'm saying. Mm. Don't be banana. Don't be banana. It's not banana. Don't tell me what it is. I'm not. You'll know when you taste it. You'll know when I taste it too. That's what she said. Wait. Mm. Hold on. Mm. I know what it is from the smell of it. And I know I'm super confused. Mm. 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 Oh. Mm. This is stupid. It's so good. This sugar, that is so That's good. That's so good, I hate it. Mm. Oh. Yeah, it's like actually tart. Mm. It's lemon. It's giving real lemon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was the lemon tang? I'm such an asshole. This is the lemon tang that I ordered. This is, this is not the replacement cookie that I've been crying about. But this is also absolutely not the top of the cookie that was advertised for Berry White. <clears throat> Do we even know if that is the Berry White? Is there another cookie that looks like this? Show me Berry White. Let's find out what it is, I'm curious. If it has purple on the inside, then you've been a real dick. A real big green dick. Not that picture. <laughs> That's why I don't have kids, so they can't draw me pictures of a green dick. It be purple. This is not what it shows on the online. Once again, I have chosen wrong for a favorite. What do you think this is on the top? I just, it has no flavor. I'm gonna eat it. I don't like this cookie. 
Not one bit. I'm sorry. It's not a winner for me. That thing on the top is familiar, but I can't place it. It reminds um, me of a macaron shell. As for the center, again, I could do without white chocolate, but that's it's whatever. That's not what's breaking it for me. Um, there's a too much artificialness in the flavor of the berry. Not bad, but it's not one that I would order again. I don't get a lot of flavor at all in any of it, so I don't know. It's not for me. The lemon one was delicious. Outrageous. And what do you think your favorite one was out of the three that we liked the best? Lemon. I think lemon was the lemon favorite all day. Lemon. And then the first one that we had, that s'mores one, was really good. I would definitely want to order more cookies from Megalicious. These are a these are a close um, contender with Life's a Batch. Yeah. So how do you think we justify the thirteen dollar price on these? Because I do think that they deserve to be a couple bucks more than the other gourmet cookies that we've tried. There's more like moving pieces that go into making these with like the homemade puddings and mousses rather than maybe just shoving a pop tart, something else inside. But at $13 a cookie and then $35 for shipping and then you do wait two weeks before they ship out. Let's just say that I'm really glad that they had some absolute winners in there to make it worth it. Well, that's a wrap on Megalicious cookies. Spend some mega bucks and buy yourself some mega cookies. Don't forget to like and subscribe, you sweet fucks. Bye. We're the best. We're the fucking best. <laughs> We're the fucking best. I feel like I'm not sitting good on this seat. I look stupid or something. Fucking stupid. What? What? <coughs> <laughs>